Obviously, I don't have much to do in the way of math tonight, but I do want to offer some thoughts on our challengers. Everyone who gets on the show is very good at trivia. You have to be in order to pass the test. But there's nothing that can prepare you for the series of events on tape day that can really throw you off your game and cause all your rational thoughts to fly out the window. There's walking onto that stage for the first time and seeing that big board that you've only ever seen on TV and standing at that podium and holding that buzzer. Then there's Johnny Gilbert in that voice that you've heard him use so many times to introduce so many other people reading your name. Something you've wanted all your life and something you never thought you'd hear. And then, of course, there's the god Alex Trebek himself standing before you, introducing the categories and doing what he does best. Not to mention the momentum that can shift the wrong way if you miss a question or two and you start to dig yourself a hole and then start to try to get out of it and keep falling further and further in. It's a lot of things that can go wrong and just so happened that way for two of our players tonight. Doesn't mean they're bad trivia players. Doesn't mean on a different day they wouldn't have racked up several wins. Just the way it worked out today and there's nothing bad that can be said about either of them. Kristen, congrats on your win. Gotta say that was a tough, tough pair of boards. And that final clue was pretty tough too. I mean that still kind of mad about that Pisces clue. Thought it was kind of ambiguous and tough for an 800 level. But we'll leave that for someone else. We'll see you tomorrow on the final wager.